Article 183 of the Constitution of India deals with the vacation, resignation and removal from office of the Chairman and Deputy Chairman of the State Legislative Council. Vacation of Office The Chairman or Deputy Chairman may vacate his office by resigning by writing to the Governor under his hand. He may also vacate his office on the following grounds. If he ceases to be a member of the council. If he becomes disqualified for being a member of the council. If he is absent from all meetings of the council for a period of more than 60 consecutive days. Resignation. The chairman or deputy chairman may resign by writing to the governor under his hand. The resignation shall take effect on the date it is accepted by the governor. Removal from office The chairman or deputy chairman may be removed from office by a resolution of the council passed by a majority of all the then members of the council. However, no such resolution shall be moved unless at least 14 days notice has been given of the intention to move the resolution. Procedure for removal the following is the procedure for removal of the chairman or deputy chairman from office. A member of the council shall give notice in writing to the secretary of the council of his intention to move a resolution for the removal of the chairman or deputy chairman. The notice shall be accompanied by a statement of the reasons for the proposed removal. The secretary of the council shall circulate the notice and the statement to all members of the council at least 14 days before the date of the meeting at which the resolution is to be moved. On the day on which the resolution is to be moved, the chairman or deputy chairman shall have the right to defend himself. After the chairman or deputy chairman has had a reasonable opportunity to defend himself, the council shall vote on the resolution. If the resolution is passed by a majority of all the then members of the council, the chairman or deputy chairman shall be removed from office. Significance of Article 183 Article 183 is an important provision of the Constitution of India as it ensures that the chairman and deputy chairman of the state legislative council are accountable to the council. It also ensures that the council can function effectively even if the chairman or deputy chairman is unable to perform his duties. The Constitution of India Part 6 The States Chapter 3 The State Legislature Officers of the State Legislature Article 183 Vacation and resignation of, and removal from, the offices of chairman and deputy chairman. A member holding office as chairman or deputy chairman of a legislative council. A. Shall vacate his office if he ceases to be a member of the council. B. May at any time by writing under his hand addressed, if such member is the chairman, to the deputy chairman, and if such member is the deputy chairman, to the chairman resign his office, and c. may be removed from his office by a resolution of the council passed by a majority of all the then members of the council, provided that no resolution for the purpose of clause c. shall be moved unless at least 14 days notice has been given of the intention to move the resolution.